Hey guys, what's up? Today we are going to be doing a gear cleanse, um, helping out one of my buddies with his account, and good thing with him is he always has just a ton of gear, but I figured with this time I can kind of go through of what I'm looking for personally, and what you should and shouldn't be saving. Um, there's always a lot of questions as far as keeping like crit rate pieces or keeping healing pieces and such not so we'll go through this will probably be a little bit of a longer video but if we can get a full cleanse on uh should provide some good information so first things first we'll go into here actually And we'll just go by sets. So Mortal Warrior. Um, defense HP set. I'm simply looking for that. Because that could be used for a healer. Um, it could be used for a def uh, defensive player. Those are the only two you're going to use that this set on generally. So like this one could be a, a good healing piece. Not going to sell. Um, same here. Full defense stats. Good tank piece. Full defense stats, good tank piece. So on. And so on. So, really nothing in there. Warlord, he has nothing. Salvation. So with Salvation, um, just a healing set. What I am generally looking for in here is going to be... If it's attack based, you obviously want attack percent. Um, you're looking for attack speed and then the ancient pieces you're going to be looking for the rage regen generally but I don't think you could hit rage regen on a non-ancient piece in this set oh uh, healing effect is another great one in this set so through here um, full defense piece I don't want that another one don't no attack speed don't want that um, this could be a decent attack healer another one no attack speed nothing uh, this is a great piece it could be either an HP or an attack base healer so definitely lock that one uh, same thing here um, he probably kept this for um, a damage dealing set but Generally, he's at this point in this account where uh, you really just don't need to be doing mixed sets. Um, personally, once I started farming all my teens, you really want to try to get away from doing mixed match m mix match sets. Um, there's just so much stats applied to that two set bonus. Like, say you're doing an attack piece set. Losing that 25% attack is huge. That's the most better. That's like better than a lot of the rolls that people are going to get on one piece. So, up and losing that uh, bonus for the set is not ideal. Um, this one here could be an okay attack base healing. This one I don't want. This is an okay piece, but. Um, I really would rather have attack speed here. Another garbage one. This one I will keep just because we have attack, we have the healing effect, and we have another attack stat. Um, this one's okay. HP rolled low, so... And attack speed's all the way at the bottom. It's just something I wouldn't want to waste the resources finding out that attack speed rolled low as well um, this one you're missing both the uh, attack or HP so not really a lo whole lot going on with that one that one's just bad same with this one um, nothing good there either Another damage piece that we don't need. And an 
another damage piece. I almost sold that one on accident. <laughs> he would probably be mad about that one. I wish they would give you the option to go through and roll them through here, though. That would be a nice implement. Okay, so with life force, what are we looking for here? Um, in the future, we might see some HP nukers. But as of right now, there's not a whole lot there. Um, if the rolls roll pretty high on like um, a nuking set like this, I would consider keeping. But this doesn't even have attack percent. But with that being said, it has all three for there. Um, it could be argued to keep that piece. But like this one, it's, it doesn't got much going for it. It's got a good attack. It's got the good defense set. But other than that, it's... There's real no chance that you're going to be like, oh, okay, that could fit on a champ. The crit rate is super low. Um, attack's not great. Not much going for it. Same with this one. Usually, my minimal roll on crit rate I look to keep is about 15%. Other than that, it's just generally trash. This one I will keep. Um, it is a quad piece, as one, two, three, four, all attack stats. Might be hard to fit on somebody, but um, that would be my exception. Uh, nothing really going for that one. Um, once again, not much going on that one either. HP defense defense so that's a decent piece generally that's what I'm gonna be looking for is um, three to four HP defense defense I wanna see HP percent defense percent and either defense or HP percent other than that I'm not even gonna waste the gold rolling them um, like I said this is a niche set not used a whole bunch it can be used once it's ascended but other than that you're not going to get a whole lot of use out of it <laughs> I know a lot of you newer players see pieces like this and start drooling but <clears throat> like I said once you get to mid towards end game those pieces just really aren't that good Oh, there we go. See, you got the three stats there. Once again, this could be a good healer set as well. This one I will keep, though. Once again, we got the quad. Uh, this is a good piece here if we possibly do it on a healer. Got HP, HP, attack speed. Uh, we got, ooh, this is a great piece. Definitely keep that one. HP, HP, defense, healing, another good one. See, if this was HP or defense, it would be a lot better of a piece. Nothing much going there. I didn't fully see that one. No. Trash. Um, attack speed healing effect, but we don't have HP or defense. Okay, with attack, what am I 
looking for in this piece. Looking for good attack rolls, so this one instantly, no, it's not worth rolling to crit rate for me. Um, attack speed doesn't hurt, if you can see attack speed, attack percent, and uh, crit rate, that's a, another great option as well. Um, these, if they... I might end up rolling some of these because generally I'd like to see how, like, say this one rolled really high on attack and crit damage. There's probably a, a way I could use that, but since those didn't roll high, it's there's really no use to that one for me. Um, a lot of people will keep these for, like, your Dolores as well. So if you roll these two and see they both roll really high, they could be a good Dolores piece. So another piece I want, I might want to actually roll, so... I'm just going to quick glance through here and then we'll go into rolling some of these pieces just to see how good they are. Um, this is another one that could be a healing piece for Dolores or such. This one has no attack percent so instant so. Another possible Dolores piece. Uh, this one I won't even bother. Um, I don't like coming down to this last roll. It's generally a waste of gold. Oh, that's an awesome piece. Definitely want to get that one rolled up. No attack percent. Instant trash. Attack percent on the bottom. Single crit rate. Uh, not that good. Another one with attack percent on the bottom. And attack percent bottom again. So we will go now into filter. Go into our calamity. Roll to see how these go. Um, and it's garbage. I have always been pretty picky with my gear. Um, definitely some benefit to being picky, but it can be seen as negative as well. Like um, I'm potentially trashing pieces that could be used on some kind of champ. Okay, so that one rolled a purple. I'm going to see if this next one can. <coughs> See, this is a potential Dolores piece or something like that. Um, good amount of attack on it. That one almost. Almost got there. couple of these salvations I wanted to end up seeing as well. Might as well go roll those. He has so much gold. We got an event going on right now. Perfect time to do a cleanse. This one where the bottom is, but if these all roll, nope. If they rolled high enough, then I would have actually paid to see what that attack percent was. Ooh, that could have been such a good piece had that rolled high. This is another one we had high hopes for. Ooh, this is an awesome piece in the making already. If we get another one, eh, not the best. Maybe with the last one we'll hit perp. Oof, that kind of hurts. We'll definitely keep it. Um could be good for either or I 
kept this one just because of the first two subs. And it goes into the bin. Okay, so we saw all those. Life Force. I don't think there was something that we wanted to roll immediately. Oh, there was the quad. <laughs> that seems about right. All those can be rolled in due time. Or no big deal. Whirlwind, one of my favorite sets in the game. Um, typically, I try to use this on either supports or um, DPS champs. If I'm using supports, I'm looking for obviously attack speed, maybe some healing effect, and then whatever the main stat is. Whether it be HP, attack, based, um, and then DPS, I'm always looking for the three attack percent, crit rate, and either crit damage or attack. I would most likely roll just attack percent and crit rate, but everything else is getting bend. Uh, that one we'll keep just because we have the two high rolls there. Um, we have the triple here. We have the 19% crit rate. We have double attack. This one didn't roll very high, but still definitely a usable piece for where his account is. Uh, this one is just too low. 3%. There's nothing going on. It's high crit rate, but losing out on 15 to 20% crit rate or er, attack percent really just doesn't feel good. Um, that one will roll the 12 to see where it's at. We'll roll it. Same with that one. Into the bin. Into the bin. Bin. That one could be a potentially good healing piece. Same with that one, but we're missing one of the attacks. Nothing special about that. Yeah, see, crit rate down there. I hate rolling those. It's a gold trap most of the time. Uh, no crit rate there. Not much to see on that one. Same there. He's going to get on his account tomorrow and see. I deleted 300 pieces. Um, this one could be a really good healing piece for an HP. You got HP percent, attack speed, healing effect, and HP. That's awesome. Uh, HP healing effect. That one could be two, but it's just too far down there to gamble on the HP. Ooh, definitely want to check that one out. That's one of his best pieces. Then we'll go in. We'll go into our whirlwind. Um, Enhance, Auto 8. Let's hope these keep rolling high. Uh, generally, I won't want to do this, but with these, I have a feeling this one could roll here. It's either going to roll about here, or it's going to roll up here. We'll take the gamble just because he has so much gold. And it paid off. Nice. A great piece high crit rate high crit damage and a relatively high attack definitely could be worse
Hmm. This is another one of those interesting ones. It's one I'd definitely keep for now. Um, missing that crit rate is definitely hard. It will take a weird kit to find. But every once in a while you'll get like a high crit rate champ like Wrath. Who has that base 15% where you can slot one of these on. Um, they are niche pieces. But in his account state, I think it could be one that could be possibly used. Into the bin. Oh, this was the really good healing one. And now it's a really bad healing one. <laughs> Got another possibility with this one here. And just not quite enough. I think that was an old one, wasn't it? It was. Okay. We have Annihilating Might left. I Can I be honest? I kind of went through this already. And that's why I decided to go through this as a gear cleanse video. That one's got the attack and crit rate. That's solo attack. We just don't need that. No attack or attack percent. Oh, well, we can't get attack, but no attack percent. No attack percent on that. Same with that one. Man, what's some duds? Okay, so we just went through about 150 pieces, narrowed it down quite a bit, probably do a little bit more narrowing down. Um, yeah, that could be usable. Yeah, so this is going to be the first part. Um, going to kind of call it here. We, I will be doing another video with the right side pieces, the... Bangles, ambulance, and rings. Um, any comments, questions, post them down below. I will definitely get back to you. Uh, yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate all the support I've been getting lately. The vi videos have been getting more views. Uh, so the subscriber count, as little as it is now, but it's going up. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. All right, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.